Hello, this is RV Vagabond Jerry, and today I'm in downtown Spokane, Washington, and I'm going to show you around Riverfront Park, the waterfalls that they have here on the Spokane River, and I'm also going to take the sky ride that goes over the falls to get a really good view from the top of the falls. So come along with me. This is what they call the Rotary Fountain, which obviously is turned off today. I suppose it's sort of like a splash pad when they have all of those turned on. So the water is coming out and hitting the ground here. Here's a map of the park. The Rotary Fountain is right here and the Sky Ride goes across the river and back right over the falls. And these are various hiking trails that they have. So let's take a look around the park. And the river flows from south to north over towards the dam right over there. This water is very calm, has no idea what it's in for. <laughs> Just a quarter of a mile down. This is the Connections Garden. Okay, this is the smallest lighthouse I've ever seen. Don't think it's really necessary. This harp is actually playing. You can barely hear it <laughs> through the speakers here. Now these two posts are kind of a mystery to me. They've got a bunch of golf balls buried in the concrete here. I suppose that's an art project. So next I'm going to ride the sky ride that they have here. And there's the water coming off of the dam, or as they call it, the falls. <laughs> and follow it down a bit where you can see from the sky right here. There's a post up in the falls. You can see a rainbow right there. From here on down, it actually is a waterfall. On the right side, you can see it going over the rocks a little better. That's a pretty nice sight. And here's the other side. That's right under the bridge. Now the sky ride is turning around to go back where we were. There's some kind of horse and rider sculpture there. It's a pretty short sky ride. It just goes over the falls and back. There's another nice view coming directly at it. There's that sculpture. Oh, this is a nice ride. And in case you don't know, Spokane hosted the World's Fair in 1974. And one of my big regrets in life is that I have never been to a World's Fair. 
They still hold World's Fairs on a very irregular basis, but for the last many, many years, they have been in other countries overseas that I've not been able to get to. This is one of the many pavilions around the park here that was used for the World's Fair and they are maintaining them. Although the insides of the pavilions and buildings and things are all closed. Here's a close-up of that tower I showed you earlier. I don't see a sign saying what the name of it is or the purpose. They have a sculpture in the middle of the river here. And look at all the birds over there. That's where they like to congregate. Somebody here must have a really large child. <laughs> Got a ladder on one side and an escape hatch on the other. We have an indoor carousel here, which is not running today. Can't see much through the glass. That is a real pretty one. There's the carousel building. They also have a roller skating rink here, which nobody is using today. I used to roller skate when I was a teenager. And this one is really interesting. It just goes around and around like this. It's not just one big rink. It's got a planned route. And we have a bunch of runners here. This is the winner. Way ahead of <laughs> number two. And three. And four, five, six, seven, and eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two. 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, and 38, and the little kid is 39, if I counted right. This is a man. And this is a woman. They all have really strange looking hips. I wonder how that helps or deters in running. <laughs> they have a bunch more of these rusty sculptures. And here is a wide view of the falls area. If you're really into hiking or bicycling, they have a hiking biking trail that starts at the Idaho state line and goes all the way across here to downtown can or I am now and then the trail follows the river all the way up to Nine Mile Dam and then who knows how far north it goes all along the river there well folks that's about it for the riverfront park footbridge there where you can go across. Hope you've enjoyed the video. Good day.